Okay, so let's con we will con we will discuss the permutations and combinations. So this lesson uh, by Holt McDougall, because it actually nakita ko medyo mas madaling itindihin at magandang lecture. So setting up. Would you like to know how much money you need to ensure your win to a Lotto game. So we have, diba, itong Ultra Lotto, Lotto, Grand, Super, Mega Lotto. So alam natin, gano'n ba kalaki ang i-spend natin para tayo ay manalo. Diba, remember, we have six combinations. 1 to 42, diba? Ayan, o. Pag-chinect natin yan, may bahol umulit. Kunyari, for example, dyan tayo sa Lotto. So we have 42 times 41, times 40, times 39, times 38, times 37. So, we have, naku, grabe, ang laki. That is billion combination numbers. So, 377 billion, 696 mil, no, 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 ulit. That is three billion seven hundred seventy-six million nine hundred sixty-five thousand nine hundred twenty combinations. Pag minuti pa rin natin yan sa palagi na twenty pesos ang taya. So we have tako po seven point five five times ten to the tenth. Napakalaki ng gagalusit mo para malakot manalo ka. So we have to evaluate. So, nakita nyo doon kung gano'ng kalaki pera ang expend natin para manalo. So, we have 5 times 4 times 3 times 2 times 1. So, we have 120. Diba? 7 times 6 times 5 times 4 times 3 times 2 times 1 is 5,040. Dito naman is 4 kasi pwede natin cancel 3 and 2 sa ilalim. So, 4 times 1 is 4. Dito naman pwede 4, 3, 2. Diba? So, 6 times 7 times 5 times 1 is 210. So, dito naman, pwede natin cancel ito. Ayan, 5, 5 times 4 is 20. Divide mo sa 2 is 10. Diba? Ito, pwede rin ito ma-cancel. Diba? 5 times 7 times 6 times 5. Divide by 4 times 3 times 2 times 1. So, we have 70. So, yan lang yan. Diba? Madaling mag gawin yung ganyan. So our objective is to solve or to solve a problem involving the fundamental counting principles and then or involving permutation and combinations. And then so these are the uh bakumulari na makikita natin. We have fundamental counting principle, permutation, factorial and combination. And then so you have previously used three diagrams to find the three the number, the, I mean, the number of possible combinations of a group of objects. In this lesson, you will learn to use the fundamental counting principles. Diba yung pagbibilang? Eh, lahat naman tayo marunong magbilang, diba? So, check natin kung talaga marunong tayo magbilang. So, we have fundamental counting principles. If there are N items and M1 ways to choose at first items, or item, I mean, M2 ways to choose a second item after the first item has been chosen and so on. So there, there are M1, M2, and MN, so on, ways to choose N items. So, using this one example, to make a yogurt perfect, you choose one flavor of yogurt, one fruit toppings, and one nut topping. So, how many parfait choices are there? So, ito yung flavor natin. So, meron tayong plain and vanilla, sa fruits, peaches, strawberries, bananas, raspberries, and blueberries, sa nuts, almond, nuts, and walnuts. Yan mga pagpipilihan natin. So, check natin ha. So, sabi dyan, number of flavors times number of fruit times number of nuts equals number of choices. So, di ba? So, yun yung number of kuha natin. So, plain, yan, peaches, Almonds. Diba? Yan yung mga ating pangyayari. Diba? So, yan. 
plain strawberries or almonds plain strawberries peanuts plain strawberries walnuts plain bananas almonds plain bananas so hanggang sa mailagay natin siya lahat eh ang dami nila di ba so medyo nakaka tamad magsulat so kaya nilang gawin na natin so to solve for that so alam natin that dalawa yung ating flavor yung plain tsaka yung vanilla and then first natin lima tsaka dalawa yung nuts eh tatlo yung nuts I mean so 2 times 5 is 10 times 3 is 30 so we have 30 choices of parfait diba so pag nirate natin yan dapat 30 to para makompleto diba so next a password for a site consisting of four digits followed by two letters. So the letters A and Z are not used. Dino natin gagamitin itong dalawa na to. So each digit of letter many many be used more than once. How many unique passwords are possible? So check natin ha. So digit, 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 digit kasi four digits nga to. And then letter, letter. So ilan digit yan? Sampo. Bakit siya naging sampo? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 0. Diba? Kaya siya 10. Ganun din yan. 10 din yan. 10 din yan. 10. Sir, ba't ito naging 24? Kasi nga yung A and Z, hindi natin sasama. Diba? So, 24 din to. Yan. Except doon sa dalawa na yan kasi, diba? Ngayon. So, pag minutip natin yan, we will get a 5,760,000. So, ganyan kadaming combination yung pwede natin gawing password. Diba? Lawit na di lang makak... No, no, actually, lawit na yung kakapindot mo bago maisip, makuha yung password. Next. Ayan o, oh, diba? So, for example, 00, BB. Yan yung una mo pwedeng gawin password. Dire-direcho kang ganyan, no? Hanggang sa makarating ka sa... Ayan. O, oh, diba? So, oh, pag nakunyan, nagawa mo na yung B... No, why? Magsisi ka dito. C, B, C, 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 D, gano'n, hanggang yan. Eh, wala ka pa sa 1, ha? Take note. Oh, so, gano'n karami yan. Nakakapagod magsulat. Kaya mag-compute ka na lang. And then next, eh, make your own adventure story. Let, let's you choose 6 start, starting points. Gives 4 plot choices. And then, has 5 possible endings. How many adventures are there? So, number of starting so we have six number of plots, four number of possible endings, five, and then number of so six times four times five. So we have 120. Diba? So ganyan tayo karami. Ganyan karami adventure sa magagawa mo. Next, so a password is four letters followed by a one digit. Four letters na mga yun at, at one digit. Kaya lang, kasama ang uppercase letter na A and lowercase letter na A. So, maybe use and consider different. So, how many passwords are possible? Check natin, ha? Letter, 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 letter. So, alam natin that 26 yung ating A, 26 din yung A na maliliit, o lowercase. So, pag natin, 52 possible letters. So, we have letter, 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 number. So, 52, 52, 52, 52, 52 and 10. Diba? Kasi 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 0. So, we have 73 million, 116,000, and 160. So, yan yan. Yan, yung possible passwords. So, there are two types of laptop here. So, we have 5 colors available. And then, we have 16 brands. So, how many total choices? So, 2. Check natin. 2. 5 and 16. So, we have 160 ways. Diba? Ganong karami. So, a permutation is a selection of a group of objects in which order is important. Remember, order is important sa permutation. Yan, tatanda niyan. For example, yan. A, B, C. Yan. A, yan. Diba? B, A, yan. So, so, there is one way to arrange one item. A. One permutation. The second item, B, can be placed at the first or at the second. Diba? Two and one. That 
a, a third can C be a first, second, or third? First, second, third. Diba? Oh, yan. So, pag nakita mo doon, so, ulit natin yan, yan na, check mo lang yung ating mga conditions. Pwede ilagay sa unahan, sa dulo, eh, dito naman, sa unahan, sa gitna, at sa dulo. Ganun din sa kabila. Diba? O, oh, pag chinect natin, 3 times 2 is 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So, we have 6 fermentation, or 6 ways, kumbaga. Meron tayo, diba? And you can see that the number of permutation of items is 3 to 1. You can extend this to permutation of n item, which is n minus 1, n minus 2, n minus 3. So this expression is called n factorial, which is written as n factorial, this one. So the factorial of the number is the product of the natural numbers less than or equal to the number. 0 factorial is defined as 1. So, for example, 6 factorial, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. O, tinan mo ito, kunyari, n natin is 6. So, 6 to, 6 minus 1 is 5. 6 minus 2 is 4. 6 minus 3 is 3, di ba? Hanggang sa 1. So, ganun lang yan. Dalawa na yan. Sometimes, you may not want to order an entire set of items. Suppose that you want to select an order of 3, people from a group of seven. seven. One way to find possible permutation is to use the fundamental counting principle. So we have first, second, third. So, ilan yan? Seven, six, five. So we have 210. Diba? Permutations. So check natin the, uh, another way. So seven factorial over four factorial. Do you remember this is 3, ha? Kasi 7 factorial over 7 minus 3 is 4. So, kaya na-cancel yan. So, we have 210. Diba? This can be generated as a formula which use, is useful for a large number of items. So, the number of permutations of 7 items taken 3 at a time. So, we have 7P3. 7 factoria over quantity 7 minus 3 factoria is equal to 7 factoria over 4 factoria. The number of, of permutation of n items taken r at the time is npr is equal to n factoria over n minus r factoria. So, yeah. So, how many ways can a student government Select a president, vice president, secretary, and a treasurer from a group of six people. So this is the equivalent of selecting and arranging four items from six. So ang n natin is six, ang four natin is president, vice, secretary, and treasurer. That is four. So we have, yeah, okay, no? Six factorial over six minus four factorial. So six factorial over two factorial. So we have. So, cancel yan. Natira natin. So, we have 360. Kasi 6 times 5 times 4 times 3 is 360. Yan. There are 360 ways to select the 4 people. How many ways can a stylist arrange 5 of 8 bases from left to right in a store display? So, 8 P5, so 8 factorial over 8 minus 5, so that is 3. 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3. So cancel itong dalawa na to. So we have this one. So yan. 8 times 7, 6, 5, 4. So we have this 6,720. Ayan. Diba? So there are 6,720 ways that the bases can be arranged. So, an award or a given out a costume party. How many ways can most creative, silliest, and best costume be awarded to a contestant if no one gets more than one award? So, we have 8 factoria. Yung 3 yung R natin kasi 1, 2, 
3. So, 8 factorial over 5 factorial is 336 ways. Ayan. Diba? To, to arrange the, war, the awards. Next. So, how many ways can a two-digit numbers be formed by using all it digits 5 and 2, 9? And by each digit being used only once. So, ayan. No? 5 factorial over... 5 minus 2 factorial, so 5 factorial over 3 factorial is 5 times, or we have 20. Diba? So, while for the next, we have the combination naman. So, a combination is a grouping of items in which order are does not matter. O dito, ha? Does not matter. Sa permutation, it matters. So, there are generally... Generally, fewer ways to select an I select items when order does not matter. For example, there are six ways to order three items, but they are all the same combination. So, permutation A, B, C, A, C, B, B, A, C, B, C, A, C, A, B, C, B, A. So, diba? One combination, A, B, C. Yan kasi permutation niya, yan kasi eh, pag-aayos, di ba? May, ay, may nakaayos, kumbaga. May order. So, to find the number combination, the formula for permutation can be modified. Number of permutation, ways to arrange all items, ways to arrange items not selected, di ba? Because order does not matter, so divide the number of permutation by number of ways to arrange the selected number. So, arrange... Ways to arrange all items. So, ito yung ways to arrange selected items. And then, ways to arrange items not selected. So, yun yung number of combinations. So, for example, the number of combinations of 7 items taken 3 at a time. So, 7C3. So, 7 factorial over 3 factorial. Quality 7 minus 3 factorial. So, the number of combinations of N items taken are a time is n c r is equal to n factorial over r factorial quantity n minus r factorial. So when this deciding whether to use permutations or combinations, first decide whether order is important. Use a permutation if order matter and matters, and a combination in if order does not matter. So you can find permutation and combination by using NPR or and NCR pala I mean, so respectively on scientific and graphing calculators. Uh, there are 12 different colored cubes in the bag. How many ways can Randall draw a set of four cubes from a bag? From the bag. So we have so we have to determine whether the problem represents the permutation or combination. Second, I know that the order does not matter cubes may be drawn in any order. Kasi nga, you know, so it's in combination. It, it's a combination. And then, use the formula for the combination where n is 12 and r is 4. So, 12 factorial over 4 factorial multiplied by 12 minus 4 factorial. 12 factorial over 4 factorial, 8 factorial. So, we have cancel yan. So, makukuha natin dyan ay 495 ways to draw 4 cubes from 12 Ayan. so the swim the swim thing has 8 swimmers 2 swimmer will be selected to swim in the first seat how many ways can the swimmer be selected so probably 8 is to n and then 2 is rr so, 8 factorial over 2 factorial multiplied by 8 minus 2 factorial. So, we have 28 ways combination. Ayan. Ayan. So, this will be your uh, short seat work. Ayan. So, I hope that na naiintindihan nyo ating diniscuss. And then, mag-enjoy kayo. And then, if, if, if there is any questions, kindly chat down. And then, sasagutin natin siya during our discussions. Okay, maraming salamat. I hope you enjoy my 
may lecture na uh, galing pa kay Holt McDougall her PA. So, goodbye. Ciao.